Previously on Historical Geocaching, my family and I are visiting Chickamauga Battlefield in North Georgia, the second most bloody battle of the entire Civil War and America's first national military park. Most recently, we've stopped at the Brotherton Cabin, where the most decisive moves of the entire battle took place. Here we are, folks, at um, Tour Stop 5 on the Chickamauga Battlefield driving loop. So I believe it's at the Heg Monument. Let's go check it out. Yes, we'll rally around the flag, boys. We'll rally once again, shouting the battle cry of freedom. We will rally from the hillside, we'll gather from the plain Shouting the battle cry of freedom Really sad to think about what happened here. I mean, really, the whole Civil War is sad. But um, I think it's really cool that, you know, after the war, the late 1880s and early, and the park was established in 1890, that veterans of both sides came together and reunited and said hey st some really important stuff happened here we need to make this a national park came together and did that our flag is proudly floating on the land and on the main shout shout the battle cry of freedom beneath it oft we've conquered and we'll conquer oft again shouting the battle cry of freedom so here we are at Chickamauga Battlefield driving tour stop six. Check this out. This is a really cool Wilder Tower. Let's check out this tower and see what awesome history we can discover. The Union forever. Hurrah, boys, hurrah. Down with the traitor, up with the star. While we rally around the flag, boys, rally once again. Shouting the battle cry of freedom. When the Confederates broke the Union line at the Brotherton Farm on September 20th, Union units here on the southern part of the battlefield were swept away like flecks of foam on a river. The Federals were simply overwhelmed and were forced to flee. The Union Mounted Infantry Brigade of Colonel John T. Wilder witnessed the disaster. Armed with deadly seven-shot Spencer repeating rifles, Wilder's men counterattacked on foot, driving Manigault's Confederate brigade backward toward the Lafayette Road. Soon Wilder realized his brigade was isolated and withdrew to this hill, which he defended against repeated Confederate assaults. Wilder then fell back to the northwest to guard the retreating columns and wagon trains of the routed Union right. While our boys have responded and to the fields have gone, shouting the battle cry of freedom, our noble women also have aided them at home, shouting the battle cry of freedom. You know, folks, there's just so many monuments here at Chickamauga. It's just amazing just, you know, to think what happened here. As I said, I'm just so thrilled that people have remembered this place, preserved it, and preserved it for history. The Union forever, hurrah, boys, hurrah, down with the traitor, up with the star, while we rally around the flag, boys, rally once again, shouting the battle cry of freedom. 